I've been asked several times recently what I was like growing up as a kid, and <laughs> I was a fucking diva. For starters, my favorite color was pink. And for those of you who are wondering if I was a gay child, well, I'm pretty sure this answers your question. I had like this huge Britney Spears poster on my wall. It was like the Oops, I Did It Again album cover. And the only reason I got it was because my friend who like lived next door was a girl had a hit me baby one more time on her door. And I was just like, oh. <sighs> So yeah, I think it's safe to say I was a pretty gay child. And it all started when I was about three years old. This was like the really gay phase of my life. Like, I'm not even kidding. My favorite movie was Cinderella. Every single night, like, I had, like, I got these, like, nice little slippers, like, for Christmas, and I used to, like, run up and down the stairs and, like, kick one off and, like, be like, ah, oh, my slipper. And my parents would all be like, ha <laughs> My gayness evolved with me into kindergarten. You know those, like, keychains that you used to hit on yourself and you used to, like, make noise upon, like, impact? Well, obviously, I had to have the pink one, I mean. And I remember I was gonna buy it, and um, the lady was like, those are for girls. You know that, right? And I was just like, bitch, I didn't ask you if it was for a girl. Now do my bidding. <laughs> exactly. Okay, but I did get a little more manly in elementary school. So, you know, growing up, sociology played its little role on me and I started liking this like boyish stuff and my parents were like there is hope after all because you know I was into like Pokemon and Power Rangers and like Hot Wheels cars and all that stuff the problem was I liked the girliest parts of those things. I used to play like Pokemon with my friends like in recess, like we would bring all our cards in and stuff like that, our little action figures, and like we would talk about like the show and like who our favorite Pokemon was. And literally Maya was Vileplume, okay? And they'd all be like, Vileplume is for girls. And I'd be like, you're literally just jealous that I caught them all, okay? And now you're gonna be sorry, because my Vileplume's about to kick ass, okay? Vileplume. Electro Ball? That's not the attack that he does. My favorite Power Ranger was the pink one. I know. I wanted to go as her for Halloween one year. My mom wouldn't let me. Instead, I went as the devil. Whenever I would play Power Rangers in the backyard with my friends, one was a guy, one was a girl, like, the one guy would always be the yellow one, I would be the pink one, and the girl would always be like, I guess I'll be the red one. <laughs> Whenever I played Mario Kart, I was Peach. I remember one time my mom, my mom would always make me eat fruit with dinner because apparently I needed to grow big and strong. Didn't work, mom. But anyway, one time she had a peach and I didn't want to eat it because the outside was fuzzy and that's weird. She was like, if you don't eat your peach, you're not allowed to be peach anymore in Mario Party, in Mario Kart. And I was just like, let's just say, I ate that entire fucking peach. Pit and all. Well, I guess the moral of the story is that I was rocking the gay thing before it was even cool. I mean, look at those shorts. And the only difference is I used to be a cute gay boy and now I'm a creepy gay man. So in the comments below, tell me what were you like as a kid? Were all the signs there? Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you next week.